So um, for my game, I created a book at. Um, my fifth grade students um, work on comparing um, decimals. So we can view this. Um, I just put in some questions um, for them to kind of answer quickly. And um, if I want, so when I want to play this with them, I can show you the answer. So just kind of like a multiple choice. Um, but when I go to play with my students, I can either, I can host it and I can select their game mode. Um, and we can either play it live or as a homework assignment. Um, so we're gonna do post game. Um, and that's kind of how you do that. Um, we can also go over here and you can look at book it. We can play it solo so that you can kind of see what it looks like. Select game mode, um, cafe, um, new game, um, new game. I don't need a tutorial because I know how to use it. So we need to restock our food, which means we need to get an answer correct here. So we go here, we get the correct answer. Um, and then we can feed toast to one of our customers, but we might need to restock. So this helps the students to kind of um, practice for a while. You can do it, they can do it more than once. They wanna restock again, because they need more. Um, so they'll just keep playing, restock. Um, if they get it wrong, so I'll get this answer wrong, just as it says incorrect, and it gives them the correct answer. Um, but now I can feed this person and I'm getting points. So that's kind of what book it is. So it's like a game inside of a game. So I give that to my students as homework or as a live game and they can have a competition.